once again, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. And thank you very much for joining us here today. I'm gonna go through the people that we need to acknowledge. Starting first with the Minister of Employment and Labor, Minister Noma Kosazana Met. The former DTIC Minister, Minister Ibrahim Patel, Deputy Minister of DTIC, Zugo Kolimpi, Deputy Minister of Labor, Ndutugo Sibia, Deputy Minister of Labor, Pumzile Mkrina, Chairperson of the Portfolio Committee on Employment and Labor, Honorable Makosonke Maneli, Honorable Members of the Portfolio Committee on Employment and Labor, Leaders of NetLex Social Partners, Organized Business, Mr. Kes Kuvadia, Organized Labor, led today by Soli Petwe, uh, Community Constituency, Mr. Tulani Chefuta, Overall Convener of Government, Mr. Tembikosi, Tembinkosi Mkalipi, Former Leaders of NetLex Social Partners, NetLex Executive Director, Ms. Lisa Seftel, the United Nations Resident Coordinator in South Africa, Mr. Nelson Muff. ILO Director, Pretoria Office, Mr. Alexio Musindo. The Chair of the PCC, Mr. Vali Musa. The ED of the PCC, Crispian Olva. PCC Commissioners. President of the High Council for Social Dialogue from Senegal. Ms. Sintab Innocence, Principal Secretary of the National Advisory Committee on Labor from Lesotho, Mr. Moshe Musase, Chairperson of the Labor Advisory Board from Eswatini, Mr. Mtunzi Shabangu, the representative of the Tripartite Negotiating Forum from Zimbabwe, Mr. Clemens Vusani, Leaders of the Social Dialogue Institutions in Africa who are joining us virtually from Algeria, Botswana, Kenya, Namibia, Madagascar, Tanzania, and throughout Africa. Leaders of sister organizations of NetLEC from the CCMA, UIF, Compensation Fund, Productivity South Africa, and Proudly South Africa. Representatives of the NetLEC Social Partners, NetLEC Secretariat, members of the media, distinguished guests. Ladies and gentlemen, good morning, and once again, thank you for joining us here today at the 29th NEDLEC Annual Summit. To kick off our proceedings, I am uh, going to give a brief overview regarding the engagements we are going to have here today. <coughs> and try and give a summary of the objectives of the summit. Now, over the past 30 years of democracy, NetLEC has focused, <coughs> apologies, NetLEC has focused on influencing policy and legislation, hosting several significant engagements and summits, and coordinating social partner responses to challenging situations. It has become, thank you, thanks Minister. It has become a proudly South African institution and has contributed to deepening democracy, strengthening policymaking, and robust social dialogue. Between May and June 2024, the social partners at NetLEC reviewed the government's 30-year report and developed their reflections on achievements and lessons learned. They have also proposed their own recommendations on socioeconomic priorities for the seventh administration including the 12 strategic priorities on which NetLEC social partners want to commit to collaborate with the government. The call in the GNU statement of intent and of the president for a national dialogue has also raised the profile of social dialogue, and it would be opportune for the NetLEC social partners to consider and indicate their role and that of NetLEC in the national dialogue. The annual summit will thus focus on these three areas celebrating the 30 years of NetLEC, determining the NetLEC's future strategic priorities, and contributing to the debate on social dialogue. And with, us short, with those short, uh, short uh, welcoming remarks, may I invite all of you to please rise for the singing of the national anthem. 
can we all rise for the singing of the national anthem and for the men in the room who are wearing hats or caps, can I please ask you to take those off for the singing of the national anthem. 